डूइंग वन थिंग एंड थिंकिंग फॉर द अदर थिंग इज अ फॉर्म ऑफ फियर मैनेजमेंट ऑफ आवर बॉडी सिस्टम एंड सिमिलर टू फाइट एंड फ्लाइट रिस्पॉन्स इट डिसरप द डाइजेशन प्रोसेस विच ट्रिगर द आई बी एस इरिटेबल बॉल सिंड्रोम इज अ डिसऑर्डर वेयर आवर स्टमक इज नॉट कम्प्लीटली क्लियर और वी नीड टू क्लियर इट टू टू थ्री टाइम्स अ डे और इवन मोर इन आई बी एस समाइम्स वी हैव ट्रेवल इन पासिंग स्टूल which gives a feel of constipation however it is different as constipation is characterized as hard and dry stool difficult to pass with very few bowel movements normally less than 3 per week further in ibs we are going to fresh ourselves many a times a day which gives a feel of diarrhea however it is different as in case of diarrhea we have loose watery stool which is quite frequent normally more than 3 times a day people having the disorder of ibs are not comfortable at workplace due to stomach problems such as gas or bowel movement even more they found difficulty in going out with a fear of motion in the midst of their journey there are few things we need to know to understand the problem first thing is peristalsis it is basically muscle contraction so as to move the food through the digestive tract these contractions should be normal means neither strong nor weak a strong contraction result into gas and diarrhea problems while weak contraction lead to hard stool and constipation the peristalsis process is controlled by enteric nervous system which communicate and interact with central nervous system second thing is coordination between brain and intestine the intestine is connected to the brain using hormones and nerve signals poor coordination between brain and intestine cause the body to over react the changes that normally occurs in digestive process the nerve become more active during stress which causes the intestine to be more sensitive and contract more now come to the most important part which is stress let us understand it through fight and flight response of our body system suppose we are resting after a meal and see a fire in our house now extinguishing the fire will become our priority work and body will focus to fight this event sleep digestion and other body process will stop as it is not the priority in case of fight and flight response body moves the blood away from the digestive system and bring it to muscles to do the needful in this case stress hormone cortisol is released to make the body alert Surprisingly fear in its subtle form is available in stress confusion hurry tension restlessness working unwillingly etc and it shows itself by doing one thing and thinking for the other thing in such cases body does not digest properly the mind as well as the body or bowel is irritated for example if i am talking to a family member or friend but my mind is engaged in some important assignment which is to be submitted the next day urgently in the office then what am i doing i am talking to the friend or thinking for the assignment or say i have committed to join someone at some place in a particular time and i am stuck in traffic or somewhere else now what am i doing i am driving or fighting the stress of meeting simply if i am taking food and watching movie at the same time then one must be less important perhaps food because it is being done only to fulfill social obligation isn't it our life is full of such events throughout the day and we are having the irritated mind and body quite frequently we should align our action and thought to overcome confusion worry restlessness etc set the priority and focus on every work take rest at regular intervals take deep breathing to release stress monitor the food intake and physical activity to keep them in harmony walk at regular intervals and exercise let me conclude the topic with very important point watch your thoughts what action they demand choose right action and make a to do list complete them with plan and focus believe me it will remove irritation from your mind and your body